Hallelujah, family. Welcome, welcome, welcome. I bring us God's fresh word again today in the name of Jesus. Wow. Put on a smiling face. My alone is a medicine to our system. Hallelujah. The Bible says, this is a day the Lord has made. Can we rejoice and be glad? Today, our prophetic word is a warning. The Lord says, I should warn you about that job. I should warn you about that job. Hallelujah. This is a prophetic word. I saw something very, very bad. Hallelujah. Please, I would like you to listen and follow this prophetic word closely so that you will not miss what the Lord has for you in the name of Jesus. Wow. There is someone under the sound of my voice. This word is for you. The Lord, the Bible says there is a way that seems right before man. Yes, a way that you will see that it's always good, but the end of it is destruction. I pray wheresoever you are joining or watching, stand that gap even if the word is not for you. It's for somebody you watching coming across this prophetic word you are coming across this word as a channel to bless that person hallelujah stand that gap to bless somebody the devil is about to frustrate the life of someone but god to reveal to redeem in the name of jesus before we receive the prophetic word in the proper my name is bazi for proper introduction hallelujah i welcome you all in the name of jesus here is prophetic channel of blessing. I will beg on you, family, to click on the subscription button to give me the privilege to become your prayer partner so that together, whenever I am live, you join me together. Let's pray. The Bible says, if there is a man to pray, there is a God to answer. Hallelujah. I want to pray for somebody. In the name of Jesus, Lord, as we receive this word, we pray for testimony at the end in Jesus' name. Amen. This prophetic word is going to somebody right now. You're about to take a move. Hallelujah. The Lord says, I should warn you about your job. Presently, right now, you are walking. Hallelujah. And there is someone coming closer to you, deceiving you and telling you that you should quit from the company of which you are walking. The God has sent me to tell you that not all jobs are from God. Hallelujah. You might be earning a little salary in a particular job of, of which that job was given to you by God. And these particular people that are convincing you, they are convincing you, they are telling you to quit, to cancel, and you are about to cancel from your company. I'm seeing you, you are about to cancel, and you are happy because this new way, you think that is good, but the end of it is destruction. The devil have just sent these people to deceive you. Once you cancel, the end of your cancellation won't be good. I want each and every one of us to connect to this prophetic word. Wheresoever you are working, that the company has value you. The company has made all your documents, your visa, everything. They take care of you, your medical insurance. They give you home accommodation and everything, no matter how stressful it is. But for the sake of what the company has done to you, your safety and everything, that shows that, that they, they love you. Hallelujah. Yes, they have shown hospitality. But these particular people that are deceiving you that you should quit from this company to join them, the Lord says, if you cancel to, to join this company, you will regret. You will regret. The end of it is destruction because this is just a setup from the enemy. The enemy just wants to frustrate your life because I know you are that point of which you, you are worried. You are saying the company don't offer you enough money. Yes, they don't do this to you. But the Lord says, wait. The Lord says, stop, wait. Don't take that decision. Hallelujah. Because something good is coming your way. Something good is coming your way. Work on yourself and offer more than what you can offer to the company. The company will promote and they will bless you. Don't cancel. Don't hear the voice of your friends. Don't follow them. Because this way seems right before you. But the end of it is destruction. A word is enough for the wife. A prophecy for one is a prophecy for all. Maybe you are watching me right now. You are about to take a decision of which is not led by God. I would like you to hold a break. Hallelujah. I'm using this prophetic word like a stone to hit other areas in our life. Let's glit on this prophetic word to work on, on our life as individual. What is that particular decision you are about to take now? Physically, spiritually, financially, you need to check is it aligned to the will of God? Is it the will of God? Or I'm just moved by emotion or by the salary or by what people are telling me. 
ask God for direction before you take any decision in the name of Jesus. God revealed to redeem. After hearing this prophetic word, if you still want to take the decision without God's direction, it's left to you. But I've done my past as a man of God to deliver God's message. I pray that as you receive this word, you will not make the wrong decision for in Jesus' name. Amen. Please don't forget to bless somebody and share this word so that it might reach to the right person wheresoever he or she is in Jesus' name. I love you all, family. As some amazing subscriber in the house, I pray the God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob will keep on coming through for you in Jesus' name. Amen.